Sorry about that. Anyway, um, so this wall is what I've been up to for the last couple of years. Uh, first thing I did is they gave me a book on um, stonework, and the first thing it said is, no matter how much of your life you spend trying to move the stone, shape it with your hands, the stone will end up shaping your hands. <clears throat> I learned a lot in between, uh, you know, if I could do it over again, I could obviously do it a uh, higher quality. Can't really take real credit, but for the amazing stones available to me. And I learned a lot about myself and that you got to spend time in each little spot in order to make it look good. This was a thing that I had had on my mind for a couple years. That and like the worst country songs. <clears throat> I love how these are like a lot of these are two toned. And uh, making these doorways too was um, some of them are pretty good, some of them are okay. But uh, as I did more and more, I really, uh, this was another cool cool bit right there but I uh, got quite a lot better at spending my time looking for bigger rocks because the time and effort it takes to fit a rock is pretty similar no matter how big it is obviously if it's a, a real big motherfucker it gets gets really 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 tiring <laughs> So you got to learn to do it all, not to specific rules, but just to a, just to a degree. Yeah. See, that's a great corner cause that's never gonna, never gonna have issue. The wall got taller as it went. The rocks are nicer. If I could go back, I probably would have done more of the mortar, but it really is a uh, very, very time consuming more of those sweet two-tone rocks this is very time consuming in order to get a, a good condition finish there because not only do you have to put it on evenly but you have to revisit it at certain intervals that change this rock is fucking awesome too it's like granite or something <laughs> anyway i'm just kind of rambling on but you know i spent time with each each and every one of these rocks over here this is one of my when i was getting better at the stonework oh yeah because there's no little rocks up top anymore and i kind of try to keep the design like uniform but that's something that i could wish i could change a little bit i like this one because it looks like a giant tooth boom and it locks locks everything in there yeah see this rock like you go pick up a rock that's bigger than your arm and gets fucking tiring and uh, this is one of Liza's favorite rocks so the reason this is colored is because the ground level is going to be roughly 18 inches and I gave this a little bit so that it should stand clear but uh <clears throat> It's a little bit of a hard job because a lot of it's uh, our, you know, artistic judgment versus how much time you're going to spend. Another sweet two-tone rock there. And these are some good ones. Like that one goes all the way back through the concrete. And then over here, these were the final stones that I laid last year. And you can see that's just like... Hey, the lights probably fucking everything up. Those are some bad rocks. Yeah. So it's like five rocks right there, like the whole, the whole schmoogle. But anyway, um, placing these stones and then 
uh, finishing. See, my mortar work over here is nowhere near as quality as the other stuff. And if I had unlimited time right now, I would actually go back and probably redo the mortar, maybe up to here. <clears throat> but uh, realize that the the real key to mortar is not laying it down. Doesn't matter how clean, how good you put it down. It's that you must go back and revisit it. And if you do not want any visible cracks or lines, you have to continually drip, drip water and not only minute by minute as it slows, but also days, um, because if you were to let it completely dry out the next day, it, it would uh, actually start cracking away from the rocks, which I had to kind of go back as I was figuring that out. But yeah, I spent a lot of time with each one of these motherfuckers. Pretty cool. My favorite one is the tooth. A little bit of that two-tone going on. <clears throat> 